This game front walkthrough is brought to you by Best Buy. Hey guys, this is Mitchell from Gamefront, and I swear to God, this is the finale of the Dark Souls walkthrough. I have not beaten yet, beaten it yet. This is still uh, live commentary, but I was really close last time to, to defeating Lord Gwyn, and I think I had. I mean, I don't want to say I had the strategy. It's it's pretty much the same strategy I've used on uh, other other bosses, and it's it's a cheap strategy, honestly. If you are a more skilled gamer than I am, I would recommend not using the strategy, but I'm at a point where I want to beat this game, I want to go home, and I need to clear my plate because I need to get ready for Uncharted 3, which I'm, I should be getting either tomorrow or Friday. Uh, so yeah, and I'll, I'll, I'll let you know what that strategy is as soon as I get there. <laughs> I, I can give you a hint, it has to do with, uh, with Iron Flesh. <laughs> it has to do with iron flesh. Uh, so for these guys, I'm I'm sick of fighting them. They're fun to fight, but after dying multiple times on Lord Gwyn, uh, you can see you can see why I would be you know so enthusiastic to take these guys out. But this is a great farming place. Uh, these guys give a lot of uh, souls per, uh, per kill, and they drop great weapons. And I think they drop, uh, frequently drop Titanite and chunks of blue, chunks of red. So they're worth killing. This is the only guy that gives me problems, but as soon as you get rid of that, oh, usually I can, uh, I can backstab him. Oh well, it's fine. It is fine. And you can see I, I got 20 Estus flasks. Uh, it's definitely something that's useful. I don't think we'll need to use them though. We'll see. Whoa! Hold on. Calm down. I'm just trying to kill your master. Alright, so first thing you want to do is equip Iron Flesh as soon as you walk in. Alright, ready? Here we go. This is where the battle is going to take place. Then, dual handed. Oh, that wasn't supposed to happen. It wasn't supposed to happen at all. Oh. If your health ever drops below 50%, that's when you want to start popping flasks. And I, I'm going to need to get ready to do another Iron Flesh. So I'm going to switch over to this. Alright. Oh, God, get out. Oh. Oh, come on. Oh, damn it. He's not going to let me get it. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Oh, I didn't want to use the flask. I wanted to use iron flesh. Come on. Come on. Yeah, I got it. Alright, I need to heal up, though. I need to heal up. Alright, here we go. You're mine, bitch. Get my stamina back. Tank that damage. Oh, so close. A little more. Woohoo! We did it, guys! We have vanquished Gwyn, the Lord of Cinder. And that's the game, guys. Let's see what happens now.
Alright guys, I guess that's the end. Um, okay, so, from the heart time, uh, let me, going into this Dark Souls walkthrough, uh, I, I was panicking. I had no idea who was going to take this walkthrough. James had never played, uh, Demon Souls. Zach had never played Demon Souls. I've played three hours of Demon Souls prior to Dark Souls, so, unfortunately that meant, uh, to my dismay at the time, that meant I had to take this walkthrough because I was the most experienced with it and going in I knew that this game had a really hardcore and dedicated fan base and I was honestly I was scared to death of you guys I, I thought you were going to tear me apart uh, with my my noobishness uh, my inability to do the simplest to kill the simplest enemies and to my surprise you guys were the most understanding, uh, supportive, uh, appreciative uh, wa subscribers or watchers, I, I don't know what I would call you guys, but uh, it overwhelmed me and this walkthrough has simultaneously been the, <laughs> the worst and the, the best walkthrough that I feel I've ever done. Um, and a lot, I honestly can't understate this enough. Thank you guys so much for all your support in helping me through this because I don't think I would have been able to get through it without you guys uh, cheering me on, uh, thumbing up my my comments that I made, my ridiculous comments, my sped up chipmunk voice, and yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know that all of your support has been so appreciated, uh, so appreciated by me, and. If you guys would continue watching, I know a lot of you guys jumped into this being Dark Souls fans, and I hope that you guys will stay uh, stick around our channel. I'm I'm not going anywhere for a while. Um, next up, I've got Uncharted. Uh, I might be able to do something with Skyrim. I know you guys have been asking for it, um, and yeah, uh, I would really appreciate you guys sticking around our channel. I think we. I'm not just saying this because I'm part of Gamefront. I really do think that we do some of the most entertaining walkthroughs uh, on on YouTube. I think we have some of the most helpful Easter egg, uh, not Easter, not helpful Easter egg. I think we have some of the most helpful achievement guides out there. Uh, probably second only to Achievement Hunter. And I think we we get out the Easter egg videos faster than most other people. So uh, thanks for listening to my little speech. I hope you guys enjoy the walkthrough. And once again, thank you so much. Please, 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 for the last time in this Dark Souls walkthrough, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.